to continue with how to make the repair I was speaking about in a previous video if there's a leak uh, around the hunter valve underwater inside the uh, Blue Echo rotating drum filter here's what you do um, right here normally this piece is there so you have to disconnect the water supply and then uh, unscrew it this way and set it aside and this is what it will what you'll have on the inside it's coming off of right here so you can pull this out of the metal wall and the hunter valve is attached right here um, I'm sorry it's the other way around um, this gasket is what is keeping the pipe from leaking against the metal side but there isn't any gasket here against the hunter valve and so all three of mine this is a place where water has been leaking underwater whether the spray bar was going or not and so um, this is what needs uh, tape around it and it's gonna let's see this ha the hunter valve has an arrow on it which I don't know if you can see in the sunlight or not here we go that arrow um, shows the direction of the water so the water line is coming in on the other side so we'll put uh, put some tape around this and then reassemble it and to get the hunter valve out you have to unscrew this piece uh, sorry about my bad camera ship but anyway this uh, this piece here unscrews you might have to start it with pliers and be careful to take that out um, and then the hunter valve itself will rotate off of the piece on the inside and let's take a look at that one okay so I already have the end taped on that one here right here ready to put the hunter valve back on and that piece is attached of course here to this spray bar and I to make it easier to get to I took this off when you take this off there's a nut that you have to start with pliers and then you can get it with your hands and then there's a small washer on it make sure you don't drop that washer down in there um, anyway then this moves this whole piece moves up and down and around to make it easy to get the l-shaped piece off the other side so um, I will go about reassembling it now uh, first I'll put the hunter valve back on the end of this piece and then I'll screw the uh, peg into the hunter valve so it um, the pin um, so it's there and then I'll put the other piece in and hopefully um, having the silicone tape on each of the threaded joints now uh, didn't come from the factory that way but when you fix it that way then on the other ones it stopped the underwater leak and hopefully that will help the water bills out 